Oh. Whew. Nothing like a cup of Pegasus piss to get you started in the morning, am I right, folks? Welcome, everybody, to twitch.tv slash loading ready run, Mimi Wheeler. This is, is this your card? Of course, the new stream, the brand new weekly stream over here at twitch.tv slash loading ready run. I would like to play some Chandelar today. I would like to play some Chandelar today. If that's okay with everybody here, then I could proceed. If not, then I can just shut it down. I do need everybody at the exact same time to tell me whether or not I'm going to do it. Now, before I do that, I'm going to give you some time to decide on what, what you're going to say, how you're going to answer by plugging patreon.com slash loading ready run. It's the reason that we're able to do all of this and uh, everything else here. Uh, also, you can support us uh, through store.loadingreadyrun.com, subscriptions here on Twitch or on YouTube or uh, memberships or whatever. Uh, or you could support us through, say, the Friday Night's Kickstarter, which is, uh, we hit the goal, we've crushed the goal, but we have other, I mean, the more money that we get, the more that we're able to do cool stuff. And, and some things that you wouldn't believe how reckless we would get for, for, with any money that we are given beyond the initial amount. Also, we'll be at MagicCon Chicago. This is technically a magic stream right now, so I think I'm going to mention it. Uh, there's going to be a bunch of us at Chicago. Chicago's like the Chandelar of the real world, right? There's just people that run up to you on the street and challenge you to a duel. That sounds about right. Anywho, uh, I've got this game that I'd like to play. Did I save? The poor people of Amanaxis Village. Ooh. You'll have to excuse me. I got a notification saying that the people of Amanaxis Village are sorry for, or sorry their quest. Sorry, the quest what? I have to give you my Sarah Angel if I lose to you. This game just immediately jumps in and tries to harass you. Immediately gets you. I'm going to duel this undead knight. Immediately gets you. I'll play first. I am potentially losing my Sarah Angel to this duel. Also, I should have looked at my deck. When I booted up the game, I was planning on looking at my deck, seeing where we were, seeing what we had so far. But then I got accosted. Marsh gas. Creatures get minus two, minus zero until end of turn. Okay. Uh, we have a white knight. I have a white knight. Hello? I have a white knight. There we go. It should be good against this mono black opponent. Yeah, they fogged my one creature. They have a black knight. Unbeatable. Unbeatable. I might lose my Sarah Angel here. Unless the AI makes an incredibly stupid decision. But we can only hope that's the case. I need to... Uh-oh. Yeah, I might just die. I mean, I can disenchant the unholy strength. And I can sword supply share as my own creature. Game. Well, if I get hit with marsh gas... I'm gonna be so pissed, you have no idea. You have no idea. Uh oh. Bad moon? That's fine. I'm going to cast Disenchant, targeting Unholy Strength. I would like to un get rid of this Unholy Strength. And I only take three. I go to four here. 
And then I'm going to... Well, first, who am I to say no to using a strip mine on my opponent with two lands? Oh, I just F6 through my turn. Basically, I did that. Uh, you know what? I went to do it as a as a bit, and then I F6 through my turn. There's no way, right? There's no way. There's just no way. If I get hit with the marsh gas here. Oh, thank God. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I BM'd my opponent, almost lost from it, and then just got a tropical <laughs> island. I could get a fork. I'm gonna take the one with the tropical island. Wait, hold on. Okay, okay, let's get let's get into the town here. So my deck has four white knights. I have a strip, I have two swords, two crusades. Okay, this looks the deck is looking pretty good. I have two mana vaults. Oh my god, we're on our way. So the deck that I have right now is uh white weenie. There are some cards that I'd like to upgrade. Pikemen and Mesa Pegasus. I'd like some more Crusades, some more Swords to Plowshares. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna be mono white for the entirety of this. Like I'm not trying to build the most optimal deck here, right? I'm not, if I wanted to, I'd just Dark Ritual into Hypnotic Spectre and it's, it's game over. Um, but I do have a second deck that I'd like to build. And thankfully, I'm getting some of the pieces of, of it. I, I only have one Triskelion. But I do have three Colossus of Sardius. I'd like to build Tron. I think building Tron would be very funny in this. Now, I have a good amount of Urza's... I mean, I have my set of Urza's Towers. I have two Urza's Mines. And I'm... You know, we're on our way. I need some Power Plants. But I got Triskelion, we got Mana Vaults. I think Mono Big Brown would be very funny to play. And so I'm gonna do that. Do I not have any quests right now? I don't, oh my God, I am a free man. I can do whatever I want. Get back in here, get back in here, get back in here, get back. I tried to get back in. I'll fight the stupid second. What are the payoffs? Diabolic Machine. Uh, Tetravis, Triskelion, Colossus of Sardia. All the best cards. Forest, you got a birds? Oh. I thought I would be a free man. I'm gonna keep up swords because I don't trust my opponent to just not just kill me. I've seen what the AI does. I've seen what they've done, what they do. I've seen how many giant growths into Berserk they cast. I look, they got a carry in ants. How do I beat that? I mean, right now, this is how I beat it. I'm going to play a, a bird. And then I'm going to pass. These banding threats. I need to get them uh, a little bit bigger. Yeah, you're activating it. You're activating it. You're hitting me for two. I'll take two. You're casting Wanderlust. During the upkeep of enchanted creature, it deals one to them. Okay. That's pretty good. I love how, um, how responsive this game is, you know, like when I click a card, it, uh, it does the thing every single time. And that's kind of beautiful. I get to swords there, carrying ants here. Activates with five mana. You are... Wait, 
Wait, what? Oh, I wanted to look at the card. I am going to Swords to Plowshares this, though. They gain a bunch of life, but I guess they we time walk them. And now they have shit. I'm gonna play a planes. I'm gonna move my hand over here. Uh, I'm gonna cast Sarah Angel. I might just die to this Wanderlust though, because my clock is my clock got quite a bit faster. And if they play an additional carry in ants, then Triskelion can just kind of clean up. Whirling Dervish. Uh huh. And an Onulet. Go to draw phase. Go to main phase. Ooh. I'm just going to play this trike right now. Play this Triskelion. Going to immediately kill this Whirling Dervish. I guess I'm going to attack you for five. Pikeman banding with the flyers. I mean, I guess they could still block, so maybe it's better if I attack with this, because then I ban these two. Then I have to remember how banding works again. Banding is a very straightforward mechanic until you uh, get prompted to, to what it does with flyers. Warp artifact? Oh my god. I'm just taking so much damage. I'm going to attack. Here's a juggernaut. Please respond. Yeah, my opponent is, like, gaming hard. If I get drain life here, it's over. I mean, I can kill my own Triskelion, and I could kill my Mesa Pegasus if I really wanted to. They're casting a Carrion Ants. Uh, I could do this here. It really doesn't like my upkeep right now. That's a good draw. I mean, they're dead, but you know, you can never tell. This could like just have a fog. They're activating the carrion ants. Okay, that's fine. And I'm going to attack with Sarah Angel. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to attack with Sarah Angel. I'm done. Yeah, I'm going to attack with Sarah Angel. Do I have to attack with this? Hello. Is there a card here that says I, ha oh, my juggernaut has to attack, right? It's not going to, magic online, magic online brain. <laughs> magic online brain. Oh, they blocked with the carrion ants too. That's nah, fine. You're dead. You're so dead. Oh my God. Underground sea. I mean, Blood Moon doesn't really do anything here. I'm going to take the cards. Anytime I get dual lands, I'm going to just take the cards. Let me back in here. Please let me in here. I need to... First, I'm going to just save. Dual, dual, duo, dual lands. A Conjurer. I wanted to go into the town. So there's nothing in this text box, right? We went over this before. There's something with the game that I'm looking at might not, might not necessarily be the game that is on screen. There's, there's nothing in that text box. What do they say? I'd love to try this deck. 
Are they just going to play with my deck? Oh, we swapped decks? Oh my god, they gave me goblins. You idiot. You gave me goblins? Oh, do you have an unsummon here? They must not know. They must not know who they're dealing with. As the premier goblin pilot of the format, they must not know. Oh, Jesus. It's okay, I got Goblin King, baby. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Unsummon my Goblin King? I'll just play him again. Are you going to counterspell me? Is this a sick tempo play? I might get got. You know what? I'm a goblins player, though. I don't have time to think about whether or not they're going to play a second unsummon. I only have time for more goblin. Jam day tome? You greedy bastard. <laughs> Jam day tome? You're really gonna have time to tap that? Not with my orcish aura flame on the field. I can't believe they gave me the Goblin King. Ooh, the Mox Pearl? I need that Mox Pearl. I'm gonna take this dungeon clue. Contains small red creatures, life loss carried over, orcish aura flame permanently in effect, west of Windlast Temple. Uh, you are a skillful magician, says the conjurer. You get a duplicate card. <gasps> swords to plowshares? Where's my swords? Swords to plowshares. Yes. The seller just suggests if you combine this conversion with this magical hack you already have, you can... You can... You can... Kiss my grits. Defeat the Warlock, which has been menacing our village. Return here and I will reward you with en with any fast effects. Okay. I have three days. I gotta find the Warlock that's harassing this village. That's my game plan. Let's find this Warlock. Let's kick this Warlock's ass. Um, and then we can... And then we can... Um, I don't know. Go grab the Mox Pearl. Staff of Thunder. 300 gold pieces. Risk one red amulet to destroy the nearest creature. No, I don't. Are you the warlock? You look like a warlock. You're a necromancer. Apologies. The evil black wizard has sent his most trusted servant to test your strength. You must duel this necromancer. Okay. I'll go first. Come on, white knight. Interesting. Four white knights in the deck. Didn't draw it. Unlucky. I got the savannah lion, so... They put an evil presence on my... Now it's a swamp. My mana is in shambles. My lands are in shambles. Somebody forced this Urborg onto my planes, and I did not want that. Stop it. Dude, stop. I just want to cast my Tundra Wolves. Is that too much to ask?
Wall of Bone. Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, now it's kind of over. Now it's kind of over. I am just going to play my Crusade here. Get that pressure going. Uh... I mean, do we want the AI? I kind of want the AI to... I'll just do this. I still want to push damage. I was thinking about loading them all up and the AI is probably just blocking with the wall. Is their deck even legal? What do you mean? Two evil presents, wall of bone? I don't think they banned that yet. Wall of bone only got banned in... Um... Wall of bone got banned in uh, a much later year. All right, now I'm going to band. Uh, Wallabone is assigning damage to my Savannah Lions. I'm going to play the strip. And I'm going to strip one of your swamps. And then I'm going to play a protection from black creature. Good luck, have fun. Good luck, have fun. Good luck, have fun. Good luck, have fun. And I still have my Tundra Wolves on deck. Oh, zombie master. Oh. The Sarah Angel. I can't cast it because I stripped them. Uh, you're at six. So I'm just going to attack with everything. Gen one. I don't care if you got rid of my Savannah Lions. That card did so much. Play out the Tundra Wolves. What are you gonna do? Pestilence me? You can't. You can't even drain life. You cast a bog ring. All right. White Knight, get in. That's it? I don't get any, I got nothing? I didn't get anything? Are you the warlock? You're the warlock. And I get your hippie. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll kick your ass. You rage quit. <laughs> this is so fucked. I had evil presence into evil presence and I still lost. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Welcome to Chandelar, baby. <laughs> Let's just strip you on turn one. Keep it one lander. Uh oh. I mean, usually White Knight's enough to get this going. Let's go, White Knight. Don't you hate it when you strip your opponent and they still just like go land, land, land into Pit Scorpion? That sucks. Just like, okay, I guess uh, everything I did uh, didn't matter. Great, now my whole strategy is invalidated by Pit Scorpion. Okay. Because uh, that's cool. Oh. oh, they're a poison deck. Oh my god. They're a poison deck. I'm just going to play this Crusade. So they have this Pit Scorpion. It's a three mana one one that if it damages a player, they get a poison counter. If they have 10 or more poison counters, they lose the game. Uh, and they played Thanos' Wand, which is a four mana artifact that has pay two generic. Um, pay two generic, uh, target creature with power two or less becomes unblockable. We, w we win the race though? I don't know. They're at three and we're at zero poison counters. It's gonna be close. The Warlock processes putting Pit Scorpion into his deck. Merc Dwellers. I am going to attack you with my White Knight. The Power Plant. The Power Plant. It's it's coming together. It's coming together. We got the power plant and I defeated the, I defeated the warlock. We did it. Oh my God. We actually completed a quest. 
We completed a quest the same day. Wow, this is what it feels like. The people are glad to be rid of the pesky warlock. You're rewarded with, uh, which card do I seek? The swords to plowshares? Yeah. Oh, it's over. It's so over. That's what they mean by <laughs> fast effect. They meant an instant or interrupt. Uh, it's over. We have four <laughs> swords to plowshares in my deck. <laughs> it's, it's done. Didn't I add a sword and then take out a kismet? What am I missing? Did I accidentally add a pikeman back into the deck? Time to save. Or STP GG WP Lamel No Re. Okay, um, where, where do I need to go again for the dungeon? Is it runes? It's runes of Su Chan, west of Winlast Temple. Okay. Uh, west of Windlast Temple. There's Windlast Temple. So it's probably around here. All right. Up and to the right. Oh, oh no! What the fuck was that? You happen upon a. Which of these spells requires one red and four colorless to cast? Magnetic Mountain. Windseeker Centaur. Dragon Whelp. Sisters of the Flame. Pyrotechnics. That's right, it's Pyrotechnics. Yeah. Legend Staple Pyrotechnics. <laughs> An alley. This card must like ruin the AI, right? An alley from Cairo? You are a dragon. Those who enter the domain of the mighty white wizard must pay for the privilege. Will I duel? Yeah, of course I'll duel. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Uh-oh. I do lose my Juggernaut if I lose this fight. Oh, it's going to be one of those games. Well, I kind of wish I didn't have this hand. Actually, never mind. Tundra Wolves hard checks the Savannah Lions. Thanos weaponry. This is, this is my magic. This is my magic. I imagine that people here, uh, folks on Loading Ready Run, that know, that like, or sorry, folks that know me primarily through Loading Ready Run, um, and the kind of magic that I enjoy playing, uh, I imagine it's the, uh, ooh, I imagine they think of the, like, combo and artifacts and all that. Um, but this is my bread and butter. This is what Benny Boy grew up on. Um, yeah, hold on. I want to read this Thanos weaponry again. Did they target my Tundra Wolves? Okay. Honestly, you seem to enjoy most types of magic aside from Time Vault. Even then, I don't I hate Time Vault anymore. Um, I... Yeah, you're not killing me with anything, right? It has to be exactly Berserk. I'm going to take it. I'll go to swords. 
I will need to draw like a crusade or a Triskelion or a Sarah Angel. You cast the second bonus with weaponry. All right. Yeah. Dorky white creatures is my, this is, this is my jam. There are a few things I love more than Savannah Lions and White Knight. Zephyr Falcon. Oh, that's a pretty good draw. I'm gonna attack. <laughs> oh my god, another strip and a tundra. Tundra's actually pretty sick. Uh, or I could get the clue for fork. Um, I'm <laughs> idiot dragon. Oh yeah, grab grab these cards. Oh wait, save, save. Second strip mine. Who am I? Surge ten years. Uh, no, not ten years ago. Oh my god, who am I? Surge fifteen years ago. I have to duel this necromancer. I didn't even get the chance to add the strip to my deck. And it's about to say something up top, but I can't see what it says. Necromancer has cried. Hello? Sure. You start with a Will of the Wisp and play. That's really rude. This Triskelion might end up getting out of this deck, but I need to get more cheap white cards. Anyway. It's kind of incredible how good magic cards are, like how how impactful it is to start the game with just like a 0-1 regenerate or like a 1-1. One, one. Like we've had games where it's like you get to start with a Merfolk of the Pearl Trident and it's just the most broken thing you've ever done. Like you're just like, I get a free 1-1? One, one? This is unbelievable. Why? Uh, oh, you missed a land drop. All right, sorry friend. Sorry, pal. I'll trade my Savannah Lions for your Skate Zombies, if you allow me. A second Skate Zombies? Oh, yeah. Well, time to swords to plowshares to the real threat on the board. <laughs> Get this Will the Wisp out of here. Bog Wraith? I should have actually... Maybe I should have attacked with Savannah Lines, given the kind of deck that they have. Now, if we draw a land, then we get to... Uh, oh, yeah, I have a Swamp from Evil Presence, so Bog Wraith is unblockable. Oh, yeah, that's that's that good cheese. I mean, you're dead, but that was sick. The evil presence into Bog Wraith combo? Oh, get out! Oh, you motherfucker. I just, I need... <laughs> This is my nightmare. This is my nightmare. I'm just trying to get shit done. And I can't. <laughs> I can't. He was ready to jump my ass. Yeah, he saw me fighting the necromancer and as soon as I was done and I'm like kind of tuckered out and I'm like, oh, thank God there's a village here. Pops out from behind the corner and is like, that's a nice watch you got, man. I'm just like, oh, fuck. I, 
You got a mistress factory in there, man? Uh, I, I, I don't, I don't need any trouble, dude. I'm, I'm just chilling. I'm just, I'm heading home. I'm broke as shit. I'm playing mono white. Look at me. I got no dual lands. <laughs> Trying to run my pockets with a fucking will of the wisp. <laughs> just, it's not happening. Oh. <laughs> Gloom? This motherfucker has main deck Gloom. Three man enchantment, white spells cost an additional three to play. Well, unfortunately, unfortunately your Gloom came a little too late. Uh, I guess I'll take the cards because I could just sell them. The Unicorn Village. Uh, do I need to sell cards? Do I need food? I probably need some amount of food. Okay, I need to add this strip. Like, I don't need this Winds of Change. I don't need Acid Rain. Probably don't need this Alley from Cairo. It's Amru Kithkins. I'll keep them just in case. Don't need Blood Moon. Blue Elemental Blast I might need. I'll, I'll keep the, the Circles and the City of Brass. But like all this other chaff. I'll keep dark rituals too. And drain lifes if I have any. I'll play this heal healing salve is 125 gold. I'll keep the magical hacks. If I get uh some northern paladins. <laughs> excuse me. Uh I might play that magical hack. I could play the magical hack with uh White Knight. That's a sick combo. You magical hack for people that don't know what this card does. Oh. Oh, where'd you go? It's one blue instant. You change the text to target spell or permanent by replacing all instances of one basic land with another. Um. Oh, wait, no, I need the other one. Not magical hack. I need a uh, sleight of mind. Shit. Then why am I keeping these magical hacks? <laughs> I need sleight of mind. Uh, I'll keep prodigal sorcerer and mind blast or uh, psi blast. The mind blasting my transmute artifact. Get out. Spell blast. Get out. I don't know. I, I think I want to keep some of these really bad white cards because who knows? I could just go through like a series of bad beats that leave me without any cards to play. And that would be terrible. I keep boiling, Oh, I didn't add the strip. I can't believe they stole a Mishra's factory from me. Got to double check. Uh, now I'm gonna buy a bunch of food, so I don't ever have to think about it. I need to go up and to the right. I could accept some of these quests, actually. Hold on, wait. Let me back in the village. You failed. Right, I failed this village. <sighs> okay. Okay. No, get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. I am an elementalist. Oh, gem bazaar. Okay, so this is a digital only card. It's like out original alchemy. Uh, when gem bazaar comes into play, you choose a random color. Yeah, I guess I'll fight you. I've got to make way. Oh, I'm anting a strip mine. This might be bad. I'm clearing the path for Mulder. She needs to get to the desk water. Because my cat uh, will... My cat loves to drink uh, water on my desk. Not from my water. We don't share water. Not mainlining toxoplasmosis into my, you know, bloodstream. Um. 
But I swear to God, Mulder, if you accidentally step on something and I throw this match... I'll do nothing because I love you to bits. She's a rascal. How do you like that? I LD'd you before you could LD me. Although now I can smell the stone rain coming. I wonder if they stone rain the planes. <laughs> I didn't I didn't know that Gem Bazaar had its own music. That rules. Let's get this over here. Change to an assembly worker. Yeah. Kind of want to see what the speed run for this game is like. I bet it's pretty goofy. <laughs> you gem bizarre fireball. Oh, you fireballed my pikeman? What? I have two white knights. I mean, you're dead, but you know. And they fireballed it for three. Very interesting. Ooh. I could take these unique cards that are really dog shit. Gem Bazaar, we talked about that. Whimsy, X blue blue sorcery, play X random fast effects. That just plays X random instants. I'll take the cards for no the sake of novelty. Ooh, and I got an amulet. You happen upon a... For one green amulet, I will reveal the deck of any blue creature. No, I'm good. <laughs> Can't I just find that online? Ooh, another disenchant. I'll buy a disenchant. I think I failed this quest. Defeat the shapeshifter that has been menacing our village. Turn here and I'll reward you with three blue amulets. Yeah. Alright, where's the shapeshifter? Where you at? Is this you? The Mind Stealer. I'll fight the Mind Stealer. You mind stealing yourself for this battle? Uh, Mind Stealer has no land and chooses to mulligan. I'm not going to take a mulligan. I am going to keep. That's wild. I've never seen the AI do that. Feels like you could just cheat. You in the tank? Casting. Oh, right. They use my deck. That's what it is. Which kind of stinks. If my opponent's using my deck, it means that we're fighting against the best deck uh, that we've played against so far. You swords the white. I might regret it if they get up to a Sarah uh, angel. Oh yeah, I traded my one mana card for your two mana card. And now I'm going to play a pikeman and invalidate your savannah lines. Learn the matchup, please. I'm going to lose after saying that. I can feel it. They played a pikeman. Gonna attack in a band. And then post combat play this juggernaut. They're attacking me. I'm gonna block your savannah lines. They cast Sarah Angel. Alright. 
Mm. Well, let's attack with this and with this. You are going to assign all the damage to Pikeman. <laughs> and then I'm going to play my own Sarah Angel. That's why banning is just genuinely really fucking good. It's just <laughs> you get to you get to control combat. I I don't know why banding ended up becoming this like I guess because it's an old mechanic. Oh, the disenchant, the juggernaut, powerful. It's an old mechanic, right? Maybe that's why. It was very it's very weird to see it as the like meme mechanic. Yeah, it's it's complicated to explain. Mm, I don't know if it's that much more complicated comparatively to like any number of mechanics that we've received in the past couple of years, past five to ten years. Oh, we get a Scrubland and a Lord of the Pit. Game. Game. Yeah, there's supposed to be a shapeshifter around here. Also, is this... This looks like a dungeon, right? Newsflash! Green Wizard sends a forest dragon to attack Unicorn's Haven. Oh. Did the game freeze? Did my game freeze? Did my game just crash? Oh, no. I just couldn't click on anything. Weird. Oh, you look like a shapeshifter. Yeah, you are. Ooh, the shapeshifter. The dungeon can wait. Uh, play first. Planes. Savannah lines. Combat. Hit you. Play strip. <laughs> strip your island. <laughs> Savannah lines. A mana vault? I think they have a lot of artifact creatures, so I think I'm going to save this disenchant. Maybe I'll regret that. But like, they they had an Urza's Avenger. And they probably have the card Shapeshifter. So I'm fine with this. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's not a good disenchant. Um... Do I want to? I don't really want to attack into this. So we're just going to play this White Knight. I don't want your Triskelion to be a three for one. I mean, it is already a three for one. You, you get a body. All right. I put unstable mutation on it. That's so cool. And they put an unstable mutation on their Mishra's uh, workshop. Okay. Um... I'm going to chump block, I think. I could double block this trike. That seems not great. Although you have you have three cards in hand. If I double block trike, draw land, then we have factory plus disenchant. 
Um, wait, where'd the window go? Where'd the, where'd the window go? Hello? <laughs> Click the little sword. Oh, thank you. Um, hmm. I could jump block, take four, go to seven, crack, disenchant this if I want to. I could take nine, go to two, crack for four, you go to five. That doesn't work if I don't draw a land. Um, and I'm worried about Triskelion anyways. I think the Savannah Lions box here. I think I just I just soak it. Yeah, let's do this. I mean, I'm I, I'm dead if they have like. some number of cards like if they play two more unstable mutations it's pretty bad so here i think i want to avoid getting triskelion so i'm going to disenchant with this targeting Oh, I guess I got a target. I mean, it doesn't matter. I, I got to target the stable mutation. Change to an assembly worker. Oh, it's all oh, Hercules recall. Oh. oh my God. Hercules Recall! Um, well, actually, I should have just kept up Factory, but uh, you know what? Here's Mace Pegasus. I hope I don't die. Go to choose defenders phase. I would like to jump block your assembly worker. I'd like to attack you with a white knight. Great. Ooh, we got a trop and a city of brass. Although we could get a time lock. Uh, I'll take the dual land. And I've defeated I defeated the, the shapeshifter. Look at us, two quests. The village is glad to be rid of the pesky shapeshifter. You're rewarded with some stuff. I forget what it was. Something like a bunch of amulets. Okay, 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 hold on. Uh, shapeshifter beat down. I think this is... Oh, no, this is a temple. Hippie for 50 gold. Are you kidding me? A hippie? Why is hippie only 50 gold? I am so far away from where I need to be. How do they decide? I guess hypnotic... Is hypnotic specter an uncommon in this game? Uh, an elementalist. Okay, sure, why not? It's no negator. You are. If you are. Yeah, I gotta go northeast. If I can go five steps without getting costed for a duel, though. That would be very cool. I also, like, need to grab more one drops. Like, I could use more Savannah Lions and more Tundra Wolves. 
Gonna hit me with that stone rain. Wall of fire. Okay, that is not stone rain. Now, this wall of fire can't block my juggernaut, so I think I'm just going to pass. I don't need to swords this. Earthquake for two. Okay. That's pretty good. And the gem bazaar. Not bad. Not bad, opponent. Well, now I'm glad that I didn't swords this wall. It is so funny that... Oh, and they're fireballing my Dragonaut. It is, it is so funny to me that in early Magic, there was a huge emphasis on walls in the game. And also, the best piece of removal just doesn't do anything if you target a wall, like, most of the time. Skellion. I might still have to source this wall though. I cast a mana vault. Whoa. I mean, they have fireballs in their deck. That's kind of scary. Energy flux. Artifacts gain pay two or bury this artifact. Okay. Uh, so do, does this prompt me? I forget. How do how do how does it, do I go about doing this? Oh, I see. Oh, that's that's very cool. The artifact does gain it. It's not uh, energy flux that is doing it. So I guess that makes sense. All right, I'm going to Swords your wall. Tag you for four. I'll play out a White Knight. They paid for their Mana Vault? Damn, okay, they think this game's going on. Oh, they, they didn't tap it. They paid for the Mana Vault for Energy Flux, I see. Playing a water elemental. Oh, yeah. Pay the upkeep costs. What's upkeep costs? Not much. What's upkeep costs with you? <laughs> Attack. You go to two, eh? Chun -chun. Dang, these cards stink. Terror is pretty nice. Reconstruction might be playable. I don't know. I don't care about this fork. I'm just going to take a bunch of cards. Get a blue amulet. Stop it. Stop it. Get into the town. Leave the town. Ooh, is this a tower? This is... I don't know what that is. I'm getting hit by a hippogriff. A winged stallion. Uh, and you want my Mesa Pegasus? Are you just trying to get a date? And I get a Howling Mine broken. Howling Mine might end up being... Uh, oh, I got a Mulligan. The winged stallion does <laughs> decided to not Mulligan. Here's my white knight. You have a Mesa Pegasus. That means this crusade is still going to benefit me, but it might end up benefiting you as well. Like, there's a chance that I'm not supposed to play this crusade because I, <laughs> you start at much higher life total than I do. They unholy strength their Mesa Pegasus, 
And then they played life tap. So whenever a force becomes tapped, uh, they're going to gain a life. Which is really good. I'm going to Swords your Mesa Pegasus. Something I didn't think I would ever say in the year 2024. It's very funny to think that there's a lot of media that is, you know, that has like the year 2024 of flying cars. Every meal is a pill, you know, whatever. Uh, that kind of trope or those tropes. Uh, and then the reality is we're just playing games <laughs> from 30 years ago. Oh, <laughs> another juggernaut. Let's go. And the Howling Mine, yowza. Who dares challenge the mighty green wizard? Are you brave enough to enter my castle? Wait, hold on. I do want to enter your castle. But I want to save first. Two time big jugs. No, get it in the castle. <sighs> Alt A Cash. Sure. I'll fight you in your fake magic cards. Well, no. Savannah Lions. Uh, You want to trade your bird? Deal. Play a white knight. Vampire. Well, opponent, looks like you missed your land drop. Unfortunately, uh, I'm actually going to destroy their island and leave them with the swamp. Um, I know that the swamp lets them pump the vampire bats, but I have two white knights. So I don't think I care too much about them having black cards here. Yeah, well, actually, hold on. I should do this. I should play Savannah Lions. I should swords this. I guess I could wait until they activate. But I'm gonna go for X I'm gonna go for F6 equity. Oh interesting, you don't have any lands? That's so interesting. Anyways, here's Crusade. <laughs> oh! A fast bond? Don't mind if I do. Alright, gimme give gimme give into this green tower. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna enter the castle. A bird's a paradise in effect? What do you mean in effect? Which of these spells has power of one? Fire elemental, giant spider, wall of bone, clay statue, and leviathan. Why, that's wall of bone. Yeah. Oh. Which of these spells has the power of one? Cockatrice, cave people, crawlworm, ghost ship, scathe zombies. Uh, that's cave people? Yeah. Fuck. <gasps> you got Sarah Angel. You got plus two lives. Which of these spells has toughness of two? Land leeches, iron root, tree folk, shannon and dry, and dancing scimitar, or apprentice wizard? Why that's land leeches. Why that's land leeches, of course. 
All right, I'll fight the salamander. Forest dragon has Shannon dryads in play. Uh -oh. Oh. Oh, it's one of these. Gotcha. You're going to start with Shannon Dryads and Birds of Paradise in play. Untamed Wilds. Well, let's get on the board. A white light. Thicket Basilisk. Oh my god, they're gonna play Basilisk Lure? LRR? Basilisk, Basilisk LRR? Uh, I'm gonna play a Mesa Pegasus. I'm not actually gonna uh, swords just yet. I want them to play out the card. I have two swords to plowshares. I could probably just do this. I really thought they were going to do it. They might just play another thick of basilisk. Cockatrice, there we go. Now they're going to cockatrice lure me. So this card is a five mana two four that with flying that if cockatrice blocks or is blocked by any non-wall creature destroyed that at the beginning of combat. Um, they 100% are going to put a lure on it. I think I swords this right now. And then I can get an attack in. I can actually trade. I'll, I'll trade one damage for this. I gotta start killing them. I could have maybe left the Thicket Basilisk around. So it doesn't have flying. Itch. Sandstorm? Uh, it's one green instant deals one damage to all attacking creatures. Really good. Um, really, just a really iconic green effect. Actually, I'm kind of okay with green having uh, stuff like that, but not at one. They played Cockatrice. I guess I'm trading this for that. Make the AI think I have swords to plowshares. How many how many five drops are they gonna have? Surely they're gonna run out. Lenora Elves. Ooh. My mana is so bad. They block my bop, or with bop, which is pretty good for me. I mean, I could double strip them. I might do that next turn if they block with the elf. Crawb worm. All right. There's just like no way that this deck has berserk, right? Not that it would matter if we're just being defensive, but I'll take that trade any fucking day. Oh my god. All right, I think I'm on. I'm on this plan. <laughs> yeah, I'm sick and tired of these six drops.
Don't do anything. Don't do anything. Yeah, you can cast elves. That's fine. Oh. Get in there. Stream of life for four? Oh my god. Does life carry- life carries over between these games, right? Because this is like a slog. Yes. Okay, so I might have to do some cool shit. One, two, three, four, five. So I can like do this. Oh, it doesn't even let me do it. The game just ends. I was going to do first strike damage and then swords my thing. Wait, I get a white knight. Now remind me, does, is this White Knight permanent? You encounter a Beast Master. No. I just have it in play. Right. Okay, that's sick. Broken. So broken. <laughs> I just start the game with a 2-2 for a striker. Oh, yeah. Very cool. Uh oh. Uh oh. Naf, Asp, and Timberwolves? Oh, yeah, my health didn't. Not, my health didn't. Uh, didn't uh, carry over. Aspect of Wolf. You're attacking with your birds? One mana, one, one. Whenever it deals damage to a player, an additional one damage to that player. It deals an additional one damage to that player during their draw step. Unless they pay one before the draw. So I have to Asp Legacy? <laughs> that goes so hard. All right, I'll pay the one for the Asp Legacy. Don't talk to me. I don't want to play Legacy. I don't want to play Modern. I want to play Asp Legacy. I'm gonna I want to play, I want to play Legacy where uh, Naf Asp is uh, playable. Naf Asp, Aspect of the Wild. That is some insane shit right there. That is, like, that is messed up. Yeah. Oh, Aswan Jaguar. Okay. This one, this one I'm very familiar with. Three mana, two, two. Comes into play, you pick a random creature type uh, from my opponent's deck and you bury a creature of the chosen type. They pick knight. It is now hunting a knight. Which is actually kind of busted. Because it can just kill my white knights. In green. Untamed Wilds. They activate the Jaguar on my tap white knight. I'm gonna hit you with that disenchant, friend. Block with this pikeman. Boom. Oh, I didn't pay for my Asp Legacy. Thunder 2. I should have paid for the Asp Legacy. Yeah. Change to an Assembly Worker. Go to choose defenders. 
I'm gonna choose to defend here. They giant growth on the birds of paradise. I'm glad that I blocked. My upkeep. Pay for the asp legacy. And even if they sandstorm me, we're fine. <sighs> Fungus Master. I'll play first. This is very cool. They, uh, <laughs> I imploded starting with three man on turn one. Mm hmm Oh, Untamed Black. And, like, the reduced mana, the fact that I... Or the reduced life, excuse me. The fact that I started at 11 genuinely makes these more threatening. Like, the quality of card my opponent's playing and what I have uh, access to might end up evening out over the course of the game. But um, that's... It's very funny to me. It's just like, oh... I, uh, this card is just like genuinely uh, able to pressure a large amount of my life points. We have the swords for their ironwood tree folk or iron root. I always forget. They got islands, iron roots. There we go. Like, what do I do? If they play another one, I'm just dead. <laughs> they unsummon this and they put regeneration on their land or else. Uh, okay. Oh, I guess uh, I can block with pikemen because first strike damage pushes it out of combat. Right. Unless that's not the rule at this time. Oh. <laughs> Eh, it's one damage. When has one damage ever uh, been uh, the, the make it or break it? We'll find out. Yeah, okay. I could have blocked. Fungasaur. The combo. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. I have two lands in hand. And I'm at four. Fungus four. They're putting a regenerate on the Fungusaur. Um, I think I have to trike this down, right? If they have giant growth, it's extra shitty. But I think I have to do this. Um. Yeah, I think I have to block here. Kill your Bob. <sighs> Come on, Ref. Come on, ref. I don't want to lose to unsummon. I need like a Sarah Angel. Oh, they played a way. I didn't see that they played an Oasis. <laughs> oh, fuck. They did the Agonjo trick to me. Turn one Isamaru, turn two Agonjo, and just don't even mention it and turn your thing sideways. Oh my god, I'm fucking dead. I lose my crusade and I get kicked out. Man, I hate this fucking game. I can't have shit. No, oh, I don't want to fight you. Oh, just let me go back. You can't have shit in Chandelar.
I think I have to cut Triskelion. But I don't really have a good replacement yet. We haven't, like, been able to grab any other cheap white creatures for the deck, which is kind of unfortunate, because it's just Tundra Wolves. I just need to grab Tundra Wolves. Oh, I guess I could have crusaded here. I'm gonna level with you. I'm on tilt. I'm on tilt from that castle. They're probably dead anyways, but I'm on tilt. You've played a primal clay. Sure. Cool. Why do these people keep trying to money match me? Ooh, an Urza's mine. I need an Urza's mine. They keep trying to money match me. I was in that fucking village. There's no way. There's no way. They just like play you for a 50 and I have to say yes. Like, what am I- I can pay them to leave me alone. Like, they're like, play you for a 50, I'm like, I will give you $25 to just not have to- just don't talk to me. But yet, I can't- but it's like free money. Well, I guess I shouldn't have, uh, played this pikeman. They might unsummon. Zephyr Falcon. The Zephyr Falcons. I think I need to cut a land too. You gonna throw an unstable mutation on that bad boy? No. Okay. White Knight. It's kind of wild how above the curve White Knight actually just is for a creature released in 1993. Like, 2-mana two 2-2 two, two first strike and you can't terror it is kind of wild. Uh, yeah, I'll take these cards. Okay, I gotta add... I have another Juggernaut, right? Because that's not the worst add. This deck. Lost my Crusade. So fucked. It's so unbelievably rude. Um, I am going to save. But I got screwed. Uh, and then I'm going to take a quick commercial break. Uh, go ahead and stretch, grab some water, grab a drink, have a piss, whatever you need to do. I'll be right back. Just a couple of minutes. Uh, and we will, we're going to get that Mox Pearl one way or the other. Don't go away. <laughs> Love old video games. Just the, gotta, you gotta be clicked onto the game. In order to get any of the any of the audio. We'll get anything really. And we're back. Oh no fuck. I, leave me alone. I'm gonna pay you 40 gold to fuck off. Uh Mountain. Oh, I'm getting my ass chased down by this dragon. I don't need red cards. Dragon is left. Oh, get to whatever this is. 
This looks like a thing. No, it's just on the overworld. You will not catch me. Then you, you caught me. All right, Tusk Guardian, I'll fight you. I should really just be paying more money to these people. Maybe the ones that are offering 40 gold, I should just say no. Ooh, I got a Tundra Bolts. Didn't even see what the news flash is. I have no time for these fucking wizards. I got no time. So the Tusk Guardian's like the giant growth deck. Right? They have like a bunch of pump spells. They're honestly a pretty scary deck. Oh, I should have played the factory, but I'm probably going to play this juggernaut. Wait, when they tap their third city, I lose the game, period? Are you for real? Like, I need to be doing something? Like, I... Oh! Nobody told me! <laughs> the game didn't even tell me. So wait, I have to go... Where do I have to go? I have to go... To some... To, to like one of the cities under attack? I mean, it tells me a thing is happening, but it's, uh, you, I, I assume that I can ignore it. I thought it was like a, on an overworld, like, oh, you can go here and there's a quest. Not, oh, go, it, go here or else you'll fucking lose. <laughs> I actually don't know what my the what the object of this game is. Like what am I supposed to do? Where where is the like you win screen? How do I trigger that? Taiga, okay. And I get an ivory tower. Okay, so now now I'm terrified. Oh, I walked into a, a dungeon without thinking about it. Shit. Although this might be a mono black dungeon. Yeah, it's a mono black dungeon, right? I should have an easier time. I have to defeat the five wizards and then I defeat the final boss. The final boss is Mark Rosewater. I got a white knight. Oh my god. Oh. I get a balance? Ooh. Do this. <laughs> oh. Which of these three black... Three spells cost one black and four What? Sorry. One black and three colorless. Uh, Bograith. Got an alley from Cairo. I'm gonna fuck up this dragon. Double white knight, double swords to plowshares. Easiest game of my life. If they kill Will-O-Wisp, it's kill on sight. Ornithopter? All right, maybe not so much. 
Ornithopter is really good in your Bad Moon deck. They're probably gonna load it up with a bunch of bullshit. Yeah, they are. <laughs> yeah, they are. Um, yeah, I guess I'm going to Swords to Plowshares this card. Will o Wisp. Play a Pikeman. They're going on Holy Strength or something. Giant Strength on the Will-O-Wisp. I'm going to level with you. I uh, let it resolve because I figured the game would play a second pump spell. It didn't. So I let them gain some life when I didn't need to. They're Grixis. They're like Grixis, throw a bunch of enchantments on bullshit. Oh, this card's unbeatable. Oh, never mind. Get an R2 damage. Nice little chip. I might actually lose to this. I'll take one. A Zephyr Falcon. I'll take one. Although I think my life total... Wow, the hard counter. Will the Wisp is the hard counter here. I'm at four. Preserve my life total. Slightly. Give me that treasure. Time walk. All right, I'm out. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. We got a time walk. We got a time walk. I'm out. Go, go, get, get out of here, get out of here, get the fuck out of here, get out of here. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 we got a time walk. I, I don't want shit. Uh, I don't think I actually have, oh, you can just click on exit. Man, these games are so fucked. <laughs> Some of them are like... Uh, time walk, baby. Some of the- some of the things are like, you have to take the hardest path towards getting anything. <laughs> right? <coughs> and then other... I have to fight you. Alright, and then other times it's just like, oh, you can just click and leave. You start with a Verderin Enchantress. And you get to Wild Growth on one. Oh, you're just playing ball. I'm going to Swords your Enchantress. Because I do not want you drawing cards. Play this White Knight. War Mammoth? Uh oh. No. Wait. Now they can't really attack into my War Mammoth. 
or attack me with war mammoth oh it's the giant growth or whatever a second war mammoth I could strip them into the dirt, but I think I'm just going to uh, play out this pikeman and aim to get the Sarah Angel in play. Oh. Force of nature, huh? Why? Wait a minute. Walk your forest. Blow up your forest. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Is this, I forget if this is five or four. It's four. Swords to plowshares. <laughs> Targeting your birds of paradise. All right, great. Take eight. Oh. Okay. I need a strip. I'm dead. What is she taking again? I can't deal with these big- Oh, you take my Tundra Wolves? I can't deal with these big creatures. The big creature decks are pretty tough because I only have four swords and I don't have enough cheap cards. I need some more one drops to really get ahead of the game. Or I need to just get bigger. Winter Orb's kind of funny. I mean, if I get some Tundras, then I can start playing the Psy Blast. I have one Tundra? One Tundra, huh? I mean... What if I add a Tundra? I have three Tropical Islands, so I could play... <laughs> play Berserk? Uh... What if I add a Tundra and a Time Walk, and then cut Triskelion and, like, a Pikeman? Oh wait, no, I'm low on cards anyways. So I should probably put... I guess I want more Mesa Pegasus than anything. Mesa Pegasus. Great. Okay, where... So where do I... I need to go to Blood Sand Glade. I'm here now? So I just need to go to the right. Oh my god. 40 gold for you to fuck right off. A reb? Ooh, okay. Uh, a little and a little down. Is this it? You happen upon a... What did it say? <laughs> what card do I want? I have four white knights. I guess I want more savannah lions. Wait, three amulets for the Savannah Lions. Yeah, I'll trade. Oh my god, I can cash in my amulets. Yes, I'll trade. Wait, is it only three? What, I assume it was red amulets because it was in red? Oh no, I can use my blue amulets too. I just didn't actually press the thing. So I want the savannah lines. Okay, I have four savannah lines. 
I could have traded for more, but I just need creatures. Could have maybe gar grabbed a Tundra. This place is ruled by the Red Wizardess. To free the city, you must duel this Goblin Lord. Um, never mind. I'll come back because I'm going to switch up my deck and I'm going to add that cop red and I'll go here. Card limit is still... Is the card limit still three? No, I bought the, the powerful thing. The powerful jewel to give me... To boost me. All right, all right, all right. Let's... I'm going to, I'm going to start from scratch. I'm just going to start from scratch. So I want to, I want to get this laid out. I can have three decks saved. I know. I know. Chad, I got a process here. I got a process. Are you just literally not letting me go to three? I got a process here. Let the master go to work. Let the master go to work. Creatures. Four Mesa Pegasus. Four Savannah Lions. Four White Knights. Only three Tundra Wolves. How did this Underground Sea get in here? Oh, we got a lot of one drops now. Which is kind of nice. We'd love some Benelish Heroes. Get some Sarah Angels in here. I think I need these Juggernauts. Okay. <clears throat> then I need this Crusade. We'll grab these swords to plowshares. I'm gonna play Time Walk. Because we can. This would be 15 lands to get us up to 40. I'm very low curve, but I have two fives. What if I cut a Mesa Pegasus? And then 16 lands. I like that. So this is like my, this is my deck. This is my default deck right here. Two strip. Tundra. Maybe playing this time walk is greedy with one Tundra. Actually probably is. Um... So I would add uh, back this Mesa Pegasus. I need a second Tundra for this time walk. Uh, and then I'd add a shitload of planes. You want to see how a master deck builder does it? This is how we do it. 17 lands, 23 cards, and uh, I'm okay playing 17 lands with a relatively low curve because I got uh, two fives that I really want to hit on curve, and I got two two strips, and uh, yeah, that seems fine. Now, I'm going to go and fight the, the red wizard, so I'm going to add circle of protection red in here, um, and probably cut in Mesa Pegasus. And I'm going to say done. I'm going to leave the village. Well, I'm going to save first. Or Lions Kappa. I... Yeah, I'll play you. This is going to be a test run. Her Jackal? Look at this. Look at this opener. This is actually kind of sick.
if you don't know what a herd jackal is, uh, it's a one mana one one that you can tap to prevent target creature from regenerating. And I'm gonna swords to plowshares it. Let's get my dogs in. They've put fire breathing on my savannah lines. It's incredibly generous of them. I'm gonna hit them to one and I'm gonna play two tundra wolves. Earthquake for one. Great. We do need some more crusades to make these tundra wolves really tick. Uh, I'm just going to take this dungeon clue. Soul Chant Monastery. We get a Mock Sapphire. West of Sarum Spire. Okay. All right. Let's do it. This place is ruled by the Red Wizardess. To free the city, you must duel this goblin lord. I'll duel the creature. And I'm anteing the cop red. Never before have I seen uh, so uh, such a poetic, such a poetic duel. Helm of Chatsik. Oh, and they, they're on the play with Amon's Goblin Raiders. Well, I've got Tundra Wolves. And Tundra Wolves has first strike. If they play Giant Strength or something, oh, Immolation's kind, of kind of a banger. Balloon Brigade. I'm gonna play some Lions. Gonna play a Goblin King. Gonna play giant strength on your balloon brigade. I would like to cast this card. I'd like to swords to plowshares your balloon brigade. <clears throat> Interesting. I'm gonna attack. If they want to block him, that's fine. The fewer goblins they haven't played, the better. Here's a Mesa Pegasus. They've given my creature banding. And they're playing Goblin Polka Band. They gave my creature that already has banding, banding. Goblin Polka Band has a weird... It's, it's not a real magic card. It has... Two tap pay red for... Each target, tap any number of target, random target creatures. Goblins tapped in this way, do not untap. So they, they activated Goblin Polka Band and... <laughs> it just, it just didn't do anything. <laughs> they just tapped their own fucking Goblin. Oh my God, I got all dramatic. I'm like, okay, cop red. We got the cop red in here. You know, I'm worried. There's the Goblin King. Gum King, very scary. Uh huh. Oh, I guess the chat sick lets them uh, keep their thing. That's kind of hot. Maybe I should have attacked into band, but I don't know. I have the Sarah Angel. I'm at nine. Orcish or flame, sure. <laughs> oh, 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 hmm. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. Well, they look like a really happy polycule, you know? And it didn't even tell me anything. Oh, now it's like a pretty oasis. Nice.
There's a there where was the green orb? There was a green orb nearby. I don't need this cop red anymore. Uh oh. Yeah, actually I don't I kinda wanna disenchant over a third Mesa Pegasus. There's the Gorb. They're anteing a Savannah Alliance. I'm actually gonna pay you 70 gold, because I I don't fuck with you. Although a rare Savannah. Uh, my deck's so much better now. Controls. I really need to get some more Crusades, though. They also cast a Tundra Rules. Mesa Pegasus. Savannah Lines and a Bop. I am going to change this into an assembly worker. This is old school magic. I guess I should have made them into a band, because then I can trade the Savannah Alliance to this Mesa Pegasus if I want. But I kind of want them to kill the assembly worker. Tusk Guardian casts War Mammoth. That's pretty good. I hope you can hear those church bells outside. Um, oh, maybe I should have attacked with this and then put it in a band. I'd rather that get got than the Savannah Lions. I guess now we're 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 in too deep. Um if I crusade this means that my Savannah Lions I think I put it on the Pegasus actually. Oh, right. Well, this isn't going to work. Uh, hold on. Cancel. Block. Got to choose defenders. This isn't going to work, right? It's just going to remove it from combat. But I'm not going to take... Uh... Wait, what? Oh, it doesn't remove it from combat. It just still kills my thing. Ah, whatever. That's fine. I actually, I'm okay with this trade. It's the tap blockers don't uh, take damage. That's what it is. You gotta understand. It's from before my time. It's before my time. And yet... Second one... I like my board placement. If if somebody if you were a judge at an event and the, you're and the player had their board set up like this. It's pretty infuriating. Also, force of nature, unbeatable without swords to plashers. You don't attack there? I'll attack. Sure, I'll take the rares. All right, get to the green hole. This place is ruled by the green wizard. To free the city, you must duel the forest dragon. Yeah, I'll duel the creature. This might be tough. <clears throat> this does not use the stack. Nope. Pacifism is solid removal. Pacifism wasn't out yet. 
Asphism came out in uh, Mirage. There are no Mirage cards here. The strip isn't doing too much in this match. Like maybe if they have a splashed color. War Mammoth. Cockatrice. Play Tundra Wolf. I'm gonna let you try to Cockatrice lure me. They have to have Cockatrice lure, right? Take two. I mean. Need to draw my crusade. Change to an assembly worker. Combat step. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit you for six. Boom. <clears throat> or I need to draw more uh, swords. More swords to plowshares. Please and thank you. Anua Elf. Very cool. I mean, I'm slamming. I should have... Did I save before this? Because I lose my White Knight and a Savannah Lions or something out from this. Maybe I should cut a land. Craw worm. If I attack with everything, they block this and they go to one. And I die. I'm gonna play this Vanna Lines. Maybe Kismet should be in here over Disenchant. This is this deck's really struggling. Oh, well, that's sick. Played Living Lands. <clears throat> now I'm gonna destroy your Living Lands. If I animate this, they block that and that, and then they take four. Uh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. This is such shit. I still have a, uh... Oh, fuck. Get the fuck out of here. Leave me alone! <laughs> I mean, I have to duel the ape lord. Hunt down some Armageddons? Ooh, yeah, some Geddons and... I mean, I have Winter Orb, but... Orb is not really that great against the deck that starts with Llanowar Elves in play. Thankfully, I have a Savannah Lions. Like, I just had a fifth Savannah Lions. I know I'm on the draw, but... Eat Lord. <clears throat> we could also play white black. I have a scrub land. Play white black and just have uh, some terrors. 
discarded. <laughs> they discarded killer bees. Hell yeah. Let's go Savannah Lions. Could you imagine playing this game with like a slower deck? Like I imagine for the boss fights, that's the way you should play, but... Oh, that Detonate doesn't do anything here. Like, imagine playing, like, a control deck against all the random mobs. Just everything takes so long. I got a strip. Oh, yeah, I'm going to take these cards over fork. Uh. Okay. So I should still have a Savannah Alliance here. Also, I have three mana bolts. That's very funny. But I need to get another White Knight now. Also, I'm going to cut a land for Strip. I should probably just cut... A, like, another land. Just go to 16. I need two cards in here. I mean, maybe Winter Orb is fine. Kismet. Mesa Pegasus? Sure. Um, okay, before I can beat the, the green... What was I trying to do? Windlass Temple? I was trying to get over here. So let's do that. No. The Sedge Beast. I'll fight you. I need to, like, go to an area with a bunch of white cards. Oh, I got a mulligan. <laughs> uh. Well, love this mulligan system. Oh, I had one land. Oh, and they they now have one land. Now I have a... <laughs> this is Magic the Gathering. This is Magic the Gathering. <laughs> this is Magic the Gathering. Hmm. Oh. It's over. <laughs> yeah? You really want to do this? Maybe Benelish Hero would have been a better uh, buy than Tundra Wolves. I think Benelish Hero... No, Benelish Hero was a common still. I'm thinking of... Um... <clears throat> I'll take the Dungeon Clue. I want that Mox Sapphire. Soul Chant Monastery. No instants or interrupts allowed. What? And Crusade is permanently in effect. Contains small white creatures. That... Oh, and I got an animal. That might be pretty good. I'm just at this place again. Um, Windlass Temple. Are there reputable sites to buy this game? Where we're going, you don't even need to buy this game. I'll duel the sorcerer. You don't have to buy this game. And quite literally, the company that 
I guess made this game also was just like, hey, uh, here's a download link for this game. Which is very funny to me. Or they, they maybe not a direct, like they were like, hey, you ever want to play Shondalar? Here's Gabby's video on how to play Shondalar. Yeah, Internet Archive has one. Ooh, Alibaba. Alibaba's kind of hot. The Brass Man? And a Mons Goblin Raiders. Grassman's legit. <laughs> Let's get that Brassman. Brassman's a very funny magic card because you show that to most people and they're just like, why would you ever play this? This card is terrible. And it's just like, one mana, one three. Lock Savannah Lions? That that thing attacks. Like it's I'm not saying it's the best, but it's not the worst. Ooh. Get that juggernaut down. Big jugs. <clears throat> You're attacking me with your Herjackal. Wow. Castic and Orphan. Well, no. I don't entirely understand the strategy. I guess let's play one drops and put uh, auras on it. It's not that bad of a strategy. Oh, we got a power plant. Oh my God, our deck's coming together. Woo. Okay. I'm taking these cards. <clears throat> and again, amulet. Red Wizardess sends a goblin lord to attack Shalecliff's Steading. I was already here. Shalecliff Steading. Who's Shalecliff Steading? Oh, I'm on the way. I'm, I'm basically heading that direction anyways. I'm going to keep fighting these sorcerers because they're, they're free real estate. But I would like to, you know, do some of the parts of this game that aren't just fighting random mobs. Thunderbolts. If you want to immolate something, you can immolate this. Or lightning bolt. Lightning bolt on Tundra Wolves is very funny to me. That's just like... Oh, Jesus. Uh-oh. This Balloon Brigade might end up... Uh, yeah, there you go. Look at that. We could get killed by this Balloon Brigade. And the Brass Man? Yeah, my opponent's popping off. Oh. Um... But if they like giant strength this balloon brigade, oh they giant strength Alibaba. For some reason. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna play a Savannah Alliance. Uh, I think I'm going to do this now just because I'm going to use my mana next turn, hopefully. More Mons, Goblin Raiders. I think I'm going to just play Kismet. <clears throat> oh, you. So now artifacts, creatures, lands, uh, they all come into play tapped for my opponent. Just 
still still didn't attack. But this Alibaba that's a 5-5. Five five. It's kind of interesting. Hey, let's play Crusade. Attack with the Ser Angel, and then we just attack with the Ser Angel again next turn. And even if they draw the Balloon Brigade, they can't even block. The Herd Angel. By the way, this is not what early Sly decks uh, necessarily looked like. If you wanted to build Mono Red Aggro, you could. I probably wouldn't play Her Jackal. Oh, another Colossus of Sardia. Oh, but there's a Soul Ring and Ancestral Recall. Uh, yeah, Colossus is a common. I'm gonna take uh, the clue. You get a duplicate card. I need a Crusade. <laughs> Where's my Crusade? E Yep. There we go. Yes, please. Uh, I gotta go down. Oh. Okay, another sorcerer. Not time lock. Nah, I'm playing. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go with more than one piece of uh, power nine. That's cheating. It's power nine. Two time locks. No, that shit's never been legal. Oh, fucking god. Oh, well. Not the duel I wanted for a second one. Uh, actually, yeah, maybe maybe duplicating. Duplicating the Tundra would also be pretty good, but duplicating uh, Crusade is just like, it makes my life so much easier. Deck is already not vintage legal. Oh yeah, I have a bunch of strip mines, but there's a there's a big difference between strip mine and uh strip, there's a big difference between strip mine and uh two time walks. And did you see the clue that told about a dungeon where blue cards aren't allowed? Oh my god, that's like heaven for the worst magic players you've ever met. <laughs> Crusade is banned? Yeah, different kind of ban, though. I don't want to play with restricted cards. Or, I don't want to play over the restriction. I guess that would still be Tundra- or er, Strip. You know what? Let me play my game. <laughs> oh! Oh! That's that's a really good clue, but this is Savannah means we can berserk. Versus power plant means that we can get our Tron deck, and lightning bolt is lightning bolt. So I'm gonna take the cards. No, get out of here, elephant. Uh, no, I didn't get any new white cards. So I think I wanted. Take this message west to my brother, the keeper of Blood Sand Glade. He will reward you with a mana link. No, I'm good. Uh, okay, so where is this place? Get, get out of here. Uh, I guess I'm fighting this enchantress. Yeah, we finally have a savanna for our savanna lions. Play first. I could have stripped them. Because they didn't have a mana dork on one. Oh. Yeah, well now you're just gonna... Oh, yeah. Playing this deck when it operates like this is, uh... Wait, Mana Link is HP? Oh, maybe I should get some HP. Uh, 
Uh, Mox Mox Monic Tomb. Hey, give me that clue. East of the Ferenian Tower. And I get the Hive? Okay, hold on. So, west of Windlass Temple, right? That's... West of Windlast Temple, and it looks like this. Am I not west of Windlast Temple? The Nevermore Sanctum. By this cursed rack. This wizard now needs five mana to cast. Wait, the. Wi oh, I'll buy this. I have to go to the Zephyr Oasis? Where's the Zephyr Oasis? I don't want to fight you. 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 I assume this is potentially a, a dungeon. It's not the one... Uh... I don't want to fight you. I don't actually know what this is. Hydra? Yeah, I'll fight this Hydra. It's somewhere west of it? Oh, okay. Damn, it's so wild. This, this... Good thing I start with the hive in play. Good thing I start with the hive in play. Perfect. <clears throat> it's technically west. I'm going to Swords to Plowshares this Wall of Fire. Because the only way I'm winning this game is if we get real aggressive. I'm going to get, like, Earthquaked for one. They play another Wall of Fire. And now you can, like, add it? Yeah, it's now you got fire breathing. Okay. On you. Finally, another land. Uh, let's get a flyer in here. Don't have a good attack. Detonate my hive. Oh, shit. That did so much damage to me. I didn't want this fucking hive in play. Oh, <laughs> so rude. Oh, Inferno. Oh, I'm dead. You know what? You know what? You know what? Nah, fuck it. Fuck it. Nah, fuck it. That's some bullshit right there. That's some bullshit. I'm cheating. I get my one, I get one, I, my one reload of the stream. And they gave me another, another one lander. Nice. Arguably a worse one lander than the last one. Fireballing my card for one. Okay. Unbelievably getting detonated. They detonated this stupid artifact that I do not want in play. Ooh. Mana Flare? Take one mana burn. 
They have eight mana. Am I just going to get fireballed? Oh, shy victory. That's pretty good. Go to swords to plowshares, your shy and dragon. So our angel's are actually pretty good against Shad and Dragon, especially with the Crusade, but Inferno. Okay. But now I have the Hive. Play Juggernaut. If they Inferno me again, I am going to... Fuck this. That's it. I need to get out. I need to take out my rage on this beast master. Also, I should put that cop red in my deck. And get this hive out of here. That's so fucked. I'm so mad. I am so mad. your wolves because then I'm gonna attack and drop this crusade I'm gonna swords to plowshares or grizzly bears How close are we to our Tron deck? I mean, we're missing a lot of, like, cards. Oh, not the Jaguar. Are oh, they pick one? Are they randomly selected knight? They don't get to pick. Bird. Yeah, untamed wilds. Bird. We need two more power plants. Two more power plants, then we can start popping off. What was the first artifact with colored mana in its cost? Uh, what is it? Sanc Sanctumite Mirror? Sanctumite Mirror? I don't actually know its, its Christian name, but something like that. Ooh, Aspect of the Wild on the Dirkwood Boars. Do you have a second Giant Growth? They Giant Growth my creature. I don't... Why do they Giant Growth my creature? Excuse me? Why do they Giant Growth my creature? I'm not complaining. I'm just very confused. Uh, Sarkamite Mirror. Yeah, that's the one. The power plant, do we get it? And we got web as a rare. I'll take these cards. Uh you're anteing. Yeah, sure. You have like five HP. Because they make pro plays. The problem with this, um, ooh, fire breathing on your herd jackal and a meek stone. Meek stone's kind of hot. Maybe we should get a meek stone for our deck. The problem with, um, the Tron deck is that anti sucks. Like we having to give up our um having to give up a tron land because i just like i don't know get stone rained into the dirt it's kind of just game
awkward. Play a white knight. Cast a Megas uh, Mesa Pegasus. Just have spares. Good, great advice. <laughs> just, just some incredible advice. Uh, block, block, block. And I'm just gonna attack you with my birds. Just don't lose. Five head. Don't lose 15 head. Ooh. Yeah. Bird. Bird. Sure, give me these cards. Ooh, that looks like a lush area. You happen upon... You encounter a prismat dragon... Wait. With a hoard of valuable cards, there's a Mox Pearl. I'm fighting you. I'm fighting you, dude. I'm fighting you. Oh, I'm keeping my hand. They have Wrath of God in their deck? Holy shit. All right, that's good to know. They played Black Lotus. Plains, Black Lotus... What you got? What's your follow-up? What's your follow-up here? Your black, it's on your way. <laughs> and they man up. Remember when I said I hated this game? I lied, I love this game. <laughs> I love it. Crack the Lotus and mana burn for one to play on you lit. And then I gained them all the life back. I traded my one mana card for their two cards. I'll, I'll take it. Surely this deck's not going to have another, like, Black Lotus, right? I mean, they could go, like, Landmock, Soul Ring, Wrath of God, which would be pretty bad. If I can get this Kismet in play, oh yeah. This is this is what we're here for. Play it, play a land to play tap. You're not playing a land? You gotta play a land. Ooh. This Oof. <clears throat> oh, the ivory tower. Genuinely terrifying. That's so much healing. Would love a crusade right here. Worst starting hand, including a Black Lotus of all time. Some of you haven't seen me play Magic the Gathering. Oh, discarded a disenchant. Oof. Yeah, some of you haven't seen the hands I've kept with eggs. The healing salve. Oof. Easiest Mox Pro of my life. Easiest Mox Pro of my life. Unique. Does this mean I can... Wait, I thought... Unique? Unique? New York. I'm gonna save. Mox Pearl Lamau. We did it. We did it. Get the fuck out of here. Mm. 
get that Mox Pearl in there. Also, while we're here, we can make a second deck. Wait, why do I have two? Oh. Second deck. I only have three Urza Mine? All right, never mind. Did I already check this village? I feel like I go to only this village. Shale Cliff Steading. Wait, can I warp? Can I warp? Does this mean I lose? You have no power for even an ante. Your righteous quest has failed. The evil planeswalker, Arzakhan and his gruesome minions have won. Oh, I loaded the empty deck? And it sends the game over? It literally just closed my game. It literally closed the game. <laughs> <laughs> oh oh shit oh shit <laughs> okay hold on hold on hold on oh fuck oh god <laughs> Oh, I did not expect that. Oh, I needed that. That was great. That was... Oh, that was great. <laughs> oh, you've got nothing, you pissy little shrimp? I don't want to fight you. Newsflash. The evil red wizard is tapped. Shale cuff setting. She needs two more mana to tap. Well, I need to get... I need to get over there, then. Uh... Yeah, you probably got some good stuff. I got a box, bro. Start the duel. This hand's sick. You get to go lions on one, strip you, and then, like, follow up with crusade. And I got swords in my hand? Oh, man. this game fucking sucks. Never mind, game sucks. Thundra Wolves. White Knight. Disintegrate my Tundra Wolves? White Knight. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. Soul net. What if I crusade? Free turn clock, let's go. Please don't go land earthquake. I'm begging you. Fireball for three. That's not great, but you know, I'll take it. Hey there, champ. You gonna do anything other than just, like, burn out my creatures? You got a proactive spell? Not what I had in mind. But you know what? Gives me a Sword Supply Shares target. A little worried they didn't use the mana. They have a Lightning Bolt? No, they're just... They're just not great. And you're using your soul net ability. Okay. No, you cast a second soul net. And you're casting an onulet. Oh. They get to gain so much life. Kismet. On the Hydra. Well, it's not a land for Sarah Angel. 
But Juggernaut is okie dokie in my books. <clears throat> They're casting, they, they cast the hive. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh yeah, a Diabolic Machine, we need that one. I'm taking these cards. I need this Diabolic Machine for my Tron deck. Okay, hold on. What's under attack? Oh, I, I gotta go all the way over here. I have to like check. Okay, hold on. The ruins of Su Chan, they're west of the temple and it's kind of marshy. And there's a, there's some towns. Nice mount. Andor's Reach. Defeat the Forest Dragon. I'll accept your quest. What does that say? That's just the name of the village. It's just not coming up. Eep Lord. I will pay you money to leave me alone. Oh, there's a swamp. We're close. I can tell we're close. It's gotta be around here, right? Surely it's gotta be around here. Swampy areas? What the fuck is that? I don't need more pike man. Another shadow's gonna haunt. Why is it that sometimes like look at that speed? What? Why does my character, why can my character like sprint? I'll pay you $80 to fuck off. I go faster if I'm on roads. I just walked across water. So, oh, it's gotta be here, right? Mistress War Machine, all right. Oh, the roads are these... Okay. You know, you'd, you'd think that I would understand this game by now. And I kind of do. I understand as much as... Oh, I gotta... If we draw planes, we're, we're okie-dokie here. We didn't. At least we can attack into Zephyr Falcon. Oh, not Giant Tortoise. Nope. No attacking into that. Giant Tortoise is so big. Time Elemental? Uh, I should probably swords this time elemental. But who knows? They might put like a power leak. Okay. I was going to say they might put a, a unstable mutation on something. Okay, so I have to pay two or I take two. I'm just going to disenchant this power leak. God bless the old formatting on these cards. They just stink. Psychic Venom. Oh, I see. This is what kind of deck you are. Yeah. White Knight. I'll take your Psychic Venom damage. Attack with Giant Tortoise over and over again is uh, pretty interesting. Hello? 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 
Why? Hello? Why can't I? There we go. I need to wake up the game. That's so weird. What happened? Where did, did I get anything? What's going on? <laughs> where, where the fuck am I? A shapeshifter. Oh, I'm good. Um, a mind stealer? Yeah, how about you mind stealing? No, I already made this joke. Wow, your deck stinks. I'm gonna... Stir the duel. Oh wait, you stole my deck. It shows their opening hand as being different. And then they take my deck? Very interesting. Here's a white knight. Ooh, yeah, strip. <laughs> now I'm going to strip you. Um, yeah, I got enough sword supply shares that I think I want to get this white knight off the table. Trade lines with you. <laughs> Cast my Mox Pearl. Do nothing with it. I cast it. How much black do we have? Uh, I mean, we could probably play four Dark Ritual, four Hippie at this point. But that feels like it's too easy. I know that, like, black is... Just Hippie is the best thing to do in this game, but... <clears throat> We're playing Mono White Challenge Run. I mean, I might end up playing uh, something other than white in my deck or playing a different deck. Want to trade big jugs? You do not. The world record plays Mono Red. I mean, I gotta imagine having a bunch of bolts and giant strength and, or like earthquakes and whatever. It's pretty good. I'll take five. Casting the second juggernaut. Get in there. I'm going to take these cards. I get a duplicate card. Okay. So this is when I can get the Crusade, or I could go for the Tundra. Uh, this is a lot more difficult than I want it to be. Um, I think I just want Crusade again. I'm not doubling the walk. I'm not doubling the mocks. You people don't like having fun. You don't like a challenge. Why do I want to... Why would I want to double my mocks or my time walk? That makes it way too easy. You don't want to double crusade? I don't even know where it is. Shaking my head, chat. Shaking my head. Crusade in the left pile? Crusade's right here. Unless there's two crusades. gonna take crusade this is gonna get people fucking foaming at the mouth oh i didn't mean to go into this place but crusade is in effect total casting cost of the nalathne dragon four that's a wild one to have because that's not a real magic card i mean it is 
but you know. <clears throat> it's been a long time since I've been in the Scarlet Monastery. I get a Sarah Angel. I just start with Sarah Angel in play. And now I just start with one life in play. Now I start with a white knight in play. Which of these spells has the toughness of four? Colossus of Sardia, Sanger Vampire, Wallwood, Mishra's War Machine, Script Rites. That's Sanger Vampire. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna sneak by. Oh. I got a Mox Sapphire. I, I just got a free Mox Sapphire. Now I can play my Time Walk. And now I can play uh, my Psionic Blast. Because now I got two uh, blue sources. I don't actually know what else is in this thing. I mean, I'll go, I'll fight one of these. I encountered a cleric. I'm anteing my Mox Pearl. Uh, I'm gonna start the duel, but I start with a White Knight in play and they start with a Crusade in play. Ugh, you're at six. Now you're at three. Hope you got to turn one. Meek Stone. Oh, that's kind of hot. Okay, hold on. Meek Stone is kind of cooking. Oh my god, I got such harshly metagamed. <laughs> Could have been Sarah Angel if I weren't greedy. And that person mods. Please. 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 What do you mean, greedy? I just went through... <laughs> Unbelievable. Greedy for progressing through the tunnel? I wanted to dig deeper. I'm not going to backtrack in this game. Are you out of your mind? Do you know how long that takes? Disco discover the power of double-clicking to cast? Nope. I mean, I have now. Oh my god, that's so much better. You're attacking me for three. Yeah, that's fine. They have to block. Didn't know that you could double click. Ooh, big. Okay. Counter a pallet. Start the duel. First strike creatures feel like they're going to be pretty good in this match. Oh, the panel is shooting. Here's the Tundra Wolves. Holy strength. And they didn't attack. Interesting. All right, double click the cast. No, I need to keep up my uh, planes for sorts of plowshares. Ooh. Juggernaut just dies to this really thick Benelish hero. So I'm just going to do this. Get it? It was an auto-tapper joke. Yeah, there we go. Everybody got it. 
Otto von Tapper got me. Oh, Northern Paladin. This card fucks. Oh, well, you know what also fucks? Sarah Angel. I can double click. I don't. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing it. Treasures and dungeons are all at dead ends. Oh. Interesting. So what you're saying is that there's a treasure at the end of my Twitch career? Kismet for if they uh, try to cast their own Sarah Angel or Flyer. Angry Mob. Mm -hmm. I buy Paladin. Ivory Tower. Not quite the powerhouse card from last time. If I just sneak through. Hunter Wolves. Got a Wheel of Fortune. I'm out. I'm fucking leaving. We're done. We're done. We got a Mox. We got a free Mox. And we got a Wheel of Fortune for our troubles. So now we get to... Uh, I kind of want to play City of Brass, but I don't think I need to. Not yet. Two sources should be fine. For the Splash. Mock Sapphire. Time Walk. Tundra. We can cut strip. I think I actually need to cut a strip here. And this, and a planes. And then I need to cut, I don't wanna just cut disenchant at this point. Okay. Our deck looks great. Are we pressed by time? Well, not anymore. Heather's done her, um, Heather has finished her play at forward, uh, which means that technically I could keep going. However, I have fulfilled my contractual obligation here, as well as my obligation to you, the viewer, by streaming for three hours. And I'm gonna keep it real with you. It's Sunday and I'm really tired. So I'm gonna call it there. I'm gonna save the game. Blue Splash King. And then I'm going to save the game again. Blue Splash King 2. And then I'm going to call it there. I'm going to call it there. Thanks everybody for watching and for tuning in. Uh, reminder that if you want to support the channel, you can do so by supporting us over at patreon.com slash loading ready run. Uh, it's a great place to help us out for everything we do, including these streams. Uh, but if that's not the way that you want to support us, uh, you can do it on Twitch. You can do it on YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Um, you could do it at store on loading ready run. You could do it at, uh, Kickstarter for Friday nights, whole bunch of places. Um, you could do it by giving me $20 at MagicCon Chicago. There's going to be a bunch of people there, but if you're doing it a direct donation, it's got to go through me and you can't tell anyone else. Um, also, I'm going to be streaming this again next week. Uh, we're going to be keeping up the... Uh, cock uh, not Cockatrice, what is this game called? Uh, Shondalar for the rest of January, as well as, get this, we're running it back for February. I'm just going to keep playing Shondalar until I at least win the game. That's the plan. Uh, so there's a lot of Shondalar. People seem to really enjoy these streams, uh, and I'm having a blast playing this game too. Uh, so thanks for watching, thanks for tuning in, and I will see y'all next week. Bye!